Hey guys, John here from Atrailer.com. Today we have our 2019 Toyota RAV4 in. We are test fitting the Koenig XG12 Pro tire chains. On our RAV4, our tire size is 225-65-17. So that's what this tire chain fits. If you have a different tire size, I do recommend checking out our fit guide to make sure that the tire chains you choose are a correct fit for your tire. It's also a good thing to check your owner's manual because your owner's manual will tell you specifically where you need to install the tire chains. For this vehicle, we have to install them on the front. I do like how this chain has a self-tensioning device. A lot of other options out there, we have to install it, then drive a while, get back out, and adjust more links. Whereas this one, when we get out to check on it, it's just to make sure that everything is sitting properly. This will self-tension as we drive and get the tire chain to fit tighter over our tire. Our XG12 Pro tire chains have D links in a diamond pattern. The diamond pattern gives us a more consistent ride quality over something like a ladder style chain where it's a little more clunky, you know, like running over uh, bumps. The D links are better quality than most of the other options out there, like a cable tire chain. That gives you a little bit more grip. This is much better. It's better for breaking the ice and for getting through the snow. This tire chain does a really good job of protecting our wheel. This here is like a bungee cord. It's an elastic cord here. This is plastic. These parts are plastic. And then these pieces we're going to install here on these links. You'll feed it through and then snap these over. We didn't install all these just for demonstration purposes, but again, that's going to give any place where our uh, links could potentially touch our wheel, it'll offer some more protection. I really like how Koenig thinks about us when they develop these chains. For one, this cover here, we don't have to worry about the elements ruining it. Some other chains out there that has a bag that if you put it in the ground or put it on the ground, it's gonna get wet, it's gonna get muddy, We'll have to clean it off before we can put our chains in or get the back of our vehicle muddy. This, we can easily spray it off. We don't have to worry about this getting ruined from the elements. On the back, we do have instructions in case we forget how to install it. We're not having to fumble around for instructions. We just turn the uh, container over and we can see it. And there's a hook and loop section here. So when we lay it into a carpeted uh, area, we know that it's not gonna be rolling around. Some of the other things that we will get in our kit are these plastic protectors. These will go on these certain sections of our chains to keep our wheel protected from them. We also have laminated instructions, a little more detailed than what's on the box. We have a plastic piece that we can put on the ground to help keep our clothes from getting all nasty. Some gloves in case we forget to have gloves and then some spare parts as well. So the first thing we're gonna do is grab our container here, open it up. There's four tabs, you just pull up, and then we are going to lay our chain out. Get in any uh, kinks or any places where it might be twisted. I do recommend when you, uh, when you put these away, to try to be a little more organized when you put them away because you know here we're doing this in a nice warm garage but normally this is going to be installed while we're out in the elements you're going to get frustrated because we're sitting here trying to get all these chains untangled you know you will have some some places where it's tangled where you gotta mess with but if we're just a little bit neat with how we put them away We'll take some of that frustration out, make it a little easier to install, a little quicker. So now that we have everything laid out, we don't have any uh, places where it's twisted anymore. There's a break point here where we'll divide our chain in half and the end with the yellow. We're going to stick this behind our tire and push the end with the yellow out around. And we'll pull this half of the chain around. Again, trying to keep it from getting tangled up. 
Now we'll take the two ends here. We'll bring it up behind our tire and make our connection. With our connection made, just kind of place our tire chains around. We will want to make sure there's these kind of brackets here. These are meant to be on the middle of our tread. So when we're positioning our chain, bring this red link up to this hook, and then just make sure it's all positioned correctly before we start tightening everything down. There's a center bracket. This is like an icebreaker. Make sure this is in the middle of our tread so that way uh, it's all lined up correctly. Red link, red hook. With our connection made up top, the next step is to lift up on this tab and then we'll route this plastic cover through like this. Let that tab go and start pulling up to tighten it. And we'll reach up here to this piece, pull down the hook. And that's our self-tensioning device right there. And with that, it will complete the install of this tire. We'll do it to the other side. And then the next step is to drive around a little bit, get out, make sure everything is still installed correctly. And that'll complete our look at the Koenig XG12 Pro tire chains on our 2019 Toyota RAV4. Thanks for watching.